Well, model Wolf Pack, and welcome back to a new episode of Wolf Pack Chat. In today's episode, we're gonna get a little uh, nerdy, maybe a little geeky too. Yeah. Because we're gonna talk about superhero costumes in real life. Now, what do we mean by that, Camilo? I'm glad you asked. I don't know why you would ask yourself, but <laughs> anyway. So let's use, for example, Wolverine. In the comic books, he wears a yellow spandex outfit, yeah, yep. and there's like blue on like this side, <laughs> like here. Yep. And and we've obviously seen him in like the movies, like the X-Men movies, the live action ones. And he doesn't wear that outfit. Nope. Camilla, do you know I why know. he may not? Because he'll. <laughs> 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 hey, still at fifteen. <laughs> Would you be afraid of a guy who comes in spandex and be like, yo, yeah. you just laugh at his ass. Yeah. He might kill you afterwards, <laughs> but at first yeah. he will laugh. Yeah, this is X-Men, not Magic Mike. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so in the actual movies, he like, just like what? Where's his like, leather jacket and like, yeah. white shirt? Or he's shirtless. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Because nobody talks about shirtless. Like, like, yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's like, yeah. I've only seen like, the first X-Men movie. I'm working on seeing the other ones. I only oh, yeah. watched parts of each movie. I've never watched the complete movie. Right. So yeah. But yeah, but I'll say the ones that we've seen, like there's no way he's gonna show up in a yellow spandex. He's just gonna wear what he actually wants to wear. Yeah. I mean and we can also move the conversation yes. to like Thor also, yeah. Yeah, Thor, exactly. Like the cartoons, he wearing helmets with little like feathers going out. Yeah. <laughs> and and Thor in the movies it, he looked ridiculous in a helmet, yeah. honestly. I mean he has that like long mane. Yeah. And that's like all he really needs. I mean, the outfit's pretty cool though. Yeah, and I mean, he still has a cape. He also has some sort of thing because you yeah. know he's a god. Yeah. And who else? Well, we can talk about Spider-Man. He can actually have his like actual costume. Yeah. Because honestly, what would it be in the movies if it wasn't like the one like yeah. the cartoons? It would be some stuff. random dude with fucking spider webs. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It'd just be weird. <laughs> it would be like, hey, dude, he doesn't even have an outfit. Yeah. And other heroes like Superman can have his actual outfit. Yeah. In the newest one, the Zack Snyder Man of Steel, it's kind of like more dark, but that was yeah. like a very dark movie yeah, yeah, to begin yeah. with. So of course it couldn't be like bright blue, bright red. Yeah. It was more like a dark shades of those colors. And it makes it, if it was more bright, it would be more childish, kind yeah. of. So they're trying to make it go yeah. darker. So you know. Yeah, which would be kind of weird since we're gonna see the Joker and stuff in the Suicide Squad movie. So I yeah. wonder how that's gonna go. Mm -hmm. I mean, we've kind of seen like pictures of their costumes, yeah. and it looks interesting so it's definitely gonna be weird to fit that into the dc cinematic universe as yeah. it starts um and also and the funny thing about batman it's like they're different batman outfits like yeah compare like christian bale's batman to like adam west's batman costume. adam west <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah those yeah. just both look like they're d completely different yeah. but it's funny because batman can have like sort of different costumes and stuff yeah. like that but they're all pretty cool <laughs> yeah yeah. Like, all these things here are the cool. It's just weird to look like, yeah. to be in your ridiculous costume, like yeah. in an actual movie. Like, even Hawkeye and the Avengers. Yeah. Like, in the comics, he has, like, a purple outfit. Yeah. And it's, like, purple mask <laughs> and stuff like that. Like, you'd be wearing it in the movie, people are like... Yeah, yeah, it's just weird. Yeah. I mean, he can have a little, sort of, like, a yeah. dark color, so it's kind of like a dark purple. You know what I noticed, though? What? People that have hide their identity, they keep the suit, full suit in the, in the movies, but if, they, if, they're, if their identity's not a secret, then they keep... They try to like and remove, remove any, yeah, you know, not good looking yeah. suits. <laughs> I remember when that was back the thing where superheroes would like keep their identity secret, like yeah. back in like the old Spider-Man movie days. Mm -hmm. But now it seems like it doesn't really matter because like in the Avengers, like everybody knows who they are. Yeah, and, uh, actually, because they don't have to hide their identity. Yeah, the Avengers was not really hiding identity. Mostly no. DC. Yeah, like Superman yeah, had identity. It's mostly a DC one. Well, the only one in Marvel would be Spider-Man. Yeah, it's really only Spider-Man because. There's not. I don't know if it, there's an actual um, it? in a comic yeah. where everybody knows who Spider-Man is. I have no idea. But no. in the movies, that all the movies that are made, every, no one knows who Spider-Man is, and like except for like selected few, yeah. like the bad guys and his friends and stuff like that. Yeah. Not even Aunt May knows that he's Spider-Man. <laughs> <laughs> um, are there any people that were forgetting like superheroes? Oh, remember the. Uh, Newest Green Lantern movie. Oh yeah, the CGI costume. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, yeah. That was ridiculous. Yeah. I doubt that they're gonna do that for the next Green Lantern. That Lance movie movie. has so much potential. But yeah. yeah. Well, it's funny because it was like made right before the Man of Steel one. Yeah. So if it was actually good, they would have kept like Ryan Reynolds as yeah. the Green Lantern. 
But nah, he's gonna be Deadpool now. Oh, that costume looks pretty oh, good. Oh, yeah. yeah. I mean, it's true to the actual yeah. costumes, so. Uh, Ant Man, you seen that? Oh, yeah, Ant Man's coming out, yeah. yeah. Looks pretty cool. Yeah. He's actually wearing a full costume. Yeah. I'm not sure how it actually looks like in the actual comics, but I'm pretty sure it's like... Yeah, we haven't seen the comics. Yeah. Probably. Yeah. I mean, they'll probably make a cartoon out of it. Because <laughs> that's like what they did with, like, Disney did with Guardians of the Galaxy. Like, as soon as that movie was successful, they made a cartoon out of it. Wow. I, I see. I did not know that. Yeah. I, I think I saw a commercial of it once. <laughs> oh, okay. On, like, Disney XD. You see, you should watch it, you know. No, I don't. You watch it 24 seconds. Absolutely not. <laughs> Lies, in fact. <laughs> I go, go to your house right now. Turn that TV on. This no. is the next thing. <laughs> Everything my DVR is just those episodes. <laughs> um, but yeah, I think that's all we have to really say on it. Yep. If you want to add on to, just leave in the comments. What superheroes do you think change from comics to the to the movies? And would you want to see a yellow spandex Wolverine? Would you? Thank you for watching, <laughs> liking, and commenting. And don't forget to subscribe to the Wolfpack. Yes, and also make sure to check out our Facebook page. There are a bunch of exclusive videos on there that we um, don't put on the YouTube channel, so you definitely want to check those out. They're pretty funny. Like a little bit of vlogs, a little bit of just a random, just here and there. Come here, all right. What time is it? I don't know. I forgot my watch today, guys. Bro. Oh, wait, here it is. Oh, I guess we found it. It's time for these lone wolves to roll out. Oh!